for the second grade. This is module two, lesson eight. And our objective today is I can solve addition and subtraction word problems using the ruler as a number line. Okay, so for every number of centimeters, I say, you are going to say the number needed to make a meter. So if I were to say 70, how many more centimeters do we need to make a meter? Remember, a meter is 100 centimeters long. So how many more centimeters, if we start at 70, do we need to make a meter? <clears throat> let's count, but let's count by tens. Here we go. 10, 20, 30. So how many more do we need? Write 30 more centimeters. Can you write that in a number sentence? Did you say 70 centimeters plus 30 centimeters equals 1 meter? If you did, good job. Okay, so here's our next one. This time we're going to start at 40. How many more centimeters do we need to make 1 meter? Go ahead and write that down. Okay, let's count and see. 10, 20, 30, <clears throat> 40, 50, 60. So we need 60 more centimeters to make a meter. Go ahead and write a number sentence that would go along with this. Does your number sentence look like this? 40 centimeters plus 60 centimeters equals 1 meter. If it does, give yourself a kiss in the brain. All right, here's our next one. We're starting at 90 this time. I want you to go, to, go ahead and count how many more centimeters we need. And remember, we're counting by tens. So how many more centimeters do we need to make one meter? And also, write down your number sentence. So push pause and then push play when you're done. <clears throat> okay, so let's compare what you got with what I got. <clears throat> so let's count how many more we need. 10. Okay, so we only need 10 more to make 1 meter. And this is what I got for my number sentence. 90 plus 10 equals 1 meter. Alright, we're starting at 20 on this one. I want you to go ahead and count how many more centimeters we need to make 1 meter. And then I want you to go ahead and write your number sentence. Push pause and then push play when you're done. Okay, so let's count how many more centimeters we need. Remember, we're counting by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. <clears throat> we need 80 more centimeters to, to make one meter. Let's compare our number sentences. So I wrote down 20 centimeters plus 80 centimeters equals one meter. Did you get the same thing? If you did, kiss your brain. Good job. All right, it's time for our application problem. This is our word problem. <clears throat> and remember, you can solve these problems 
however you feel comfortable using whatever strategy we have learned so far that um, you feel most comfortable using. <clears throat> so it says, Bill the Frog jumped seven centimeters less than Robin the Frog. Bill jumped 55 centimeters. How far did Robin jump? So go ahead and push pause and then push play when you're done. Okay, so how did you solve this? Did you put 55 plus 7? What answer did you get? Did you answer with 62? If you did, give yourself a kiss on the brain. Good job. Okay, so like I said in our last video, my birthday is coming up and and I want to start planning the decorations that I'm going to be putting up for my birthday party. So first I need to figure out how big my door is because I decided so I want to put streamers around my door and so I had to measure my door and I measured this side over here and I figured out that it was two meters long <clears throat> and because I know that this side is the same length as this side I know that the other side is also two meters long then I measured along the top of my door and I found out that the top of my door is one meter long. And because I know that the top of my door is the same length as the bottom of my door, I know that the bottom is also one meter long. <coughs> now, I need to figure out how much streamer I need to put around my door. So what I need to do is I need to add the perimeter, which is the outside of my door. And I'm going to add all of these numbers up to find how many meters of, of streamer I will need. So this is the number sentence I created. I created 2 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1. And so this is going to tell me the perimeter around my door and also how much streamer I will need to put around my door for decoration. So <clears throat> I added 2 plus 2 which equals 4 plus 1 more is 5 plus one more is six. And I know that I will need six meters of string, of streamer to go around my door. Okay, so I decided that, <clears throat> that it would be kind of pretty to put um, a string of lights up my the steps up to my door as decorations for my guest so now I need to measure how high the steps are and how deep the, st the steps are so that I can put lights that go up and over up and over so I found out that it is 22 centimeters deep for my steps and both of my steps are the same size so they're both 22 centimeters this way and <clears throat> I found out that they are 
18 centimeters tall. And like I said, both of my steps are the same size, so both of these are 18 centimeters high. So now I need to make my number sentence, and this is what I wrote down. <clears throat> 22 plus 22, from here and here, plus 18, plus 18. So these are pretty big numbers. And what I can do is I can break these up, and I can take 22 plus 22. <clears throat> and I came up with 44 for that. Then I can take 18 plus 18. I want you to go ahead and push pause and write down what 18 plus 18 is. <clears throat> did you come up with 36? If you did, excellent job. Now I can just add 44 plus 36. Go ahead and add those two together. Did you come up with 80. So all together I, ha I need 80 centimeters of lights to put up along my steps up to my door. So <coughs> 22 plus 22 plus 18 plus 18 equals 80 centimeters. All right so I have some banners to go up along my walls in my living room. And my living room is shaped like this rectangle. And so I need to find the perimeter of my room here. <clears throat> and so I measured one side of my living room and I got 10 meters. So it's 10 meters across here. And this is the same length over here, so I know that that's also 10 I know that that's also 10 centimeter, or 10 meters, sorry. Then I measured the side of my room, and that was 8 meters. And these two are the same, so I know that they're both 8 meters long. Now this I want you to write the number sentence that would go along with this to find out how much banners I need, how long the banners need to be to go around the perimeter of my room. Push pause and then push play when you're done. Is this the same number sentence that you came up with? 10 plus 10 plus 8 plus 8. I hope so. I want you to go ahead and figure out this number sentence. Push, push pause and then push play when you're done. Did you come up with 36 meters? I need 36 meters of banner to go around the perimeter of my living room. All right, here's your turn. This is your exit ticket. So you need to take your exit ticket and you need to answer these questions. It says, use the ruler below to draw one line that begins at two centimeters and ends at 12 centimeters. Label that line R. Draw another line that begins at five centimeters and ends at 11 centimeters. Label that line S. Then you're going to uh, answer these questions. A says add 3 centimeters to line R and 4 centimeters to line S. How big is line R now? So remember you added 3 centimeters to line R. So right here you're going to write how big it is now. Then you added five centimeter, or sorry, four centimeters to line S, 
and this is where you're going to write that answer. The new line S is blank centimeters. Is it shorter or longer than the new line R? Good luck.